Today we shall see special type of arrays present in jQuery. To illustrate the use of arrays in jQuery, we shall detach some of the HTML elements and then attach it back to the HTML document. So here we shall store the detached elements inside jQuery array and then use that stored array to restore these elements back to the HTML document. To illustrate this, we shall take an unordered list with class wedge and non-wedge. We will take another ordered list. This is an unordered list we are writing right now. In another section, we shall take an ordered list and then two buttons button one to detach the elements of unordered list another button to attach the detached elements to the ordered list so don't get confused here is how we do it an ordered list the combination of unordered and ordered list just to make sure the detachment and the attachment. So in the ordered list we have one item. In unordered list we have four items. Now we take two buttons and clicking on which we will remove these items that is with class wedge and then attach it to the ordered list here upon clicking the button attach let's see how it looks in the browser okay so once i click remove rice and wedge pizza gets detached once i click attach it gets attached to the ordered list with some numbers because it's an ordered list so with the jquery scripting here once the document is ready we see if the user has clicked button any button first we will start with the detach button if the user has clicked the remove button we call an anonymous function inside this we shall select all the vegetarian items that is all the list items with the class wedge it's a class so we need to specify dot to make it more specific we shall write li dot wedge we select all the vegetarian items and then detach it well the detached item has to be stored somewhere we will store it inside of array variable it's a special type of jquery array variable you could give any name to that variable here i have given it a name called store now once the user clicks the attach button the button with an id attach call an anonymous function and then select the ordered list and simply append it there is no attach tag method here so just append it we have many functions so let's first see with the append method of jquery and pass the array 
now rice and veg pizza okay must, must get detached once i click attach it must be attached to the ordered list well the list item inside the ordered list is also getting detached so let us make it more specific detach only list items present inside unordered list and then let's append it after the first item present inside the ordered list so there is a method called after so once i attach the detached elements it gets attached after veg paneer that is the first item so it must get attached after this rice and veg pizza there is something called before so let's see how it works it gets attached before veg paneer before this okay, rice and veg pizza since dollar store is an array variable we could even fetch array elements individually with its index number i'll start with zero now the first array is rice which gets attached here let's see the second one that is store of one which is veg pizza okay only veg pizza gets attached you can use replace with function instead of before and after you can also use some specific selectors to attach the elements back to the html document this is unlike the remove function because remove just deletes the entire structure but detach stores it and we can replace it back on demand please share this video on facebook twitter google plus linkedin etc also subscribe to our blog technotip.com and our youtube channel and please like this video on youtube